bunch of Jake Pauls up there. Look it. See the Jake Paul though? Yeah, I did, I did. There's one coming right at it. Oh my god, it's a giant! Oh! Oh no! Dude! Dang, man. You came down that hard. You know what I mean? There you go. Got him. First pitch on a G. Nice. Guys, Kitech Model 1 is a pretty cool little jig. Not a bad fish. A good start. Nice little guy. <laughs> it's a bat. Oh. That was so cool. You got him? That was so cool. You saw it, didn't you? Let's just say electronics have come a long way. <laughs> and that's about all you'll ever hear me say about that. I thought you told everybody everything on Smallmouth Crush. They can put the pieces together, Eric. Okay. Oh, how times change. <laughs> what is that? Very interesting. Kitech Model man? 1, man. So, Travis, what trailer are you throwing? So, I'm on actually yours? Sure. What, do you, what do you prefer? I'm I There's that. a lot of different trailers. You can, right? Pick Z one. Z-Man has a great trailer. Yep. Uh, right now, I'm what Z-Man trailer do you like? I'm using the Zoom Chunk right now. Okay, he's got the Zoom Chunk. I got the Baby D Bomb by Missile Baits, black and blue. It's a black and blue half ounce Kitech. Travis, you're throwing three eighths. I don't think it matters. I mean, right. we're fishing like six to seven foot. Yep. It's pre-spring. Uh, I mean, pre-spawn. Forty-nine degree water, but there seems to be a concentration of fish up there. They're not big yet, but Travis just lost a horse. I did. I that did. That was very cool. <laughs> Let's go back in and get him. He fought for me. Nice fish. He fought for me, dude. Oh, Come man. on. Come on. Man. Come on. Get a good one. He fooled me. But good job with getting that camera ready. I was running to it. Looking for. It. Whoa. Whoa. Uh huh. And that fish. Eight. That's the first typical jig bite I've had all day. You know where they actually thump it. Sure. I mean, you could you could see that she really took the bait in deep i mean like sucked it in yeah everything else been, oh, wow. i mean for you it's been a mushy bite right 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 yeah not that one man and look pinned in the roof of the mouth That's just like we talked about yep so one of the other things i like about this jig is it has a hand tied fine cut silicone skirt so i mean the uh the strands are really fine Super fine, hand tied, so you can skip this jig. I mean, it's not the greatest skipping jig. I'm not the greatest skipper, but anyway, mm -hmm. there you go, man. That's, I mean, that's either a really big male, or maybe a pre-spawn female. Sure. I don't see a lot of egg. Her belly's kind of flat. Oh, good one! Get in the boat. Oh, good one. Yeah. That's a better fish. That was fun. So this jig really gets them hooked good. What's a nice. Talk to him about that jig point. Got him. Is that him? That was crazy. <laughs> I think that was him, wasn't it? Yeah, that was. <laughs> what the heck, man? They're getting bigger. One jig. Okay, the Model 1 jig has a special custom-made hook point. Let me get this uh, fish back yeah. in the water. 
Okay. So I'm gonna. I need a new trailer anyway. Thank you, Mr. D Bomb. But uh, let's get a close up of that hook. I'm okay. I'm gonna see how the hook point tips up slightly. Yep. Goes that way, and it just helps. It really when it sticks them. As I drag this over my finger, it just engages immediately. So it, it really sticks them in the roof of the mouth. Sure. It's a smaller hook. I mean, I, I consider this a finesse jig. Uh-huh. Model one finesse. So guys, I'm flipping my Kitek Model One on 17 pound fluorocarbon. I actually have a seven foot, what is this, seven six? Heavy. Real nice bend in the rod, using the bay casting setup. It's a perfect setup, and all we're doing is we located areas where these fish are going to be coming in to spawn, and there's a lot of wood. So we're just flipping wood and flipping cut bank. It's a lot of current here, too. A lot of current. We just cast it out, pop it off the structure, you feel it, and you kind of just work it back slowly to the boat. I just put a Z-Man trailer on the back of it. And like right up here, there's a log under the water. I'm gonna drop it right in there. And we just work it back to the boat. We just keep making pitches. And we're finally starting to catch a couple big fish. A lot of little guys in here, Eric. A lot of bucks moved up, man. But that's the first stage that you know the spawn is ready to happen. The temperature did step up from the mouth from 49 degrees to 51.75 is the highest I've seen it. So, you know, generally if I go up a creek and it gets colder, I don't like to, to keep rolling. I turn around. But since it got warmer, we decided to keep on moving. That's right. Well, hey guys, get your hands on some of these Kitek Model 1s. I think you'll be impressed with them. Real compact finesse jig. Obviously, they do catch fish. They work for us today. It is a tungsten head, too. That's right. That's right. So smaller head really creates that finesse style profile. It's perfect. Yep. Well, let me know what kind of finesse jigs you guys like to throw. Leave any likes and comments below. And until next time, we'll, we'll see, see you guys on the water. On the water.